Hi, this is Morgan. I'm going to try to explain uh, CPU-Z and how to how to basically look what you need in your computer really quick. Alright, so here you just go to any search uh, engine, go to cpuid.com. You can write CPU-Z just to be sure. Um, once you go in, you'll see there is a, um, it should say CPU-ID at the top, CPU-Z. Um, set up in English, or you can get the zip file, it's quicker, and then unzip it. Uh, when you have downloaded it, let's see, so download now, and it'll download here in the bottom. Um, once you get that, you'll get some data, like this guy. He submitted his data in, it's called, a, it's just validated. This is really high stats um, that he's got. He's got a really good uh, graphics card, NVIDIA GeForce. Um, that's his score in here. Um, so example, I will show you mine. This is my my personal CPU Z. Um, so you want to go over. This is what's inside my computer. It's i7. Um, skip over here to the speed and graphics. The speed is basically from your RAM and you'll have a slot one, two, three, and four. Um, so you see I'm missing slot three. It's actually empty in my computer. Uh, so I'm, I'm getting a new uh, RAM stick. This one is only two gigabytes. Uh, earlier we saw, um, well I'll go back to that in a second, graphics, um, this is just the onboard motherboard graphics, um, this is not enough, uh, especially even making this video, the video is going to be choppy. Um, so let me show you back this guy, this guy here. Um, How can I explain it here? Here's his RAM. He's got he's got two spaces, um, eight and eight, sixteen uh, gigabytes. Graphics card is super strong. Um, and then the rest is just storage. Displays his screen. Uh, that's the motherboard. Probably not going to change that. CPU. Um, this AMD. I have. Uh, Intel and that's it um, hopefully you can download it and work it yourself